<laughs> nope. <laughs> All right, ditch or date. What do you got going on in your life right now? It's a little stressful. You got questions. You want Burt Show fam around the country to help you out. You got to hit us up at thebirdshow.com. Ditch or date. She says, so I started dating Michael just a few days ago. We met on Tinder, and I was thrilled because it's the first time I've actually gone out with someone that I met that way, and it was actually a successful match. Normally... I end up going out with them, and they are completely different than I thought. However, Michael was just as attractive and funny in person. We had such a great time, and we immediately made plans to hang out the next night. Um, Also, the second date, or after the second date, I decided I really liked him and started to hope this was going to go lead somewhere. At this point, I got really curious and eager to know everything about him. So I started to do a deep dive on social media. I learned that he and his ex broke up in December, and it seems they were together for only a few months. Before that, he was with another girl who showed up consistently in his Instagram feed for several years years there's nothing abnormal about this except for one thing and how i fit into it all all three of us look exactly alike she says i mean it's creepy not only are our physical features alike but we seem to have very familiar or similar style too i sent screen captures of the girls to a few of my friends and all of them pointed out the same exact thing They all think I should be weirded out by this. Like, is he just looking for girls to replace his original ex? Or is this his quote-unquote type? Or is his type so particular that every girl he dates is a carbon copy of the other? So is this weird enough that I should walk away? Or should I just be blunt and ask him about his quote-unquote type? from Carrie. This is a damned if you do, damned if you don't. Because I've heard both arguments here. Oh, it's so creepy that he only dates people that look like me. (laughs) And then I've also heard, oh, I saw all of his exes and they look nothing like me. They look nothing like me. So am I just not his type? So I've heard it both ways. I am so annoyed with this because I've, my whole life, I've had people be like, you know, all of his exes look like you. Or like, hey, you, our friend Pete, he's dating a girl that looks exactly like you. And then I go and look up the girl and I'm like, yes, we both have a face. <laughs> <laughs> we both have skin, a dermis. You know, it's dumb as hell because I've never like seen it myself. Like, I'm like, okay, we have brown hair. Like, not all people look the same. And sometimes like an entire squad of girls will look the same. Like, it's a style and i don't think there's there should be any qualms with this she should not be feeling insecure about this and maybe he does have a type we uh i have a friend in my friend group that only date i mean they almost look like every girl he dates looks like they could be sisters to where it's a running joke because the original that we all met let's call her tina right they broke up and then the next girl comes in and looks just like tina so we just call her tina two and then there's tina three and then there's (laughs) tina four because they all look the same (laughs) mo Uh, While I do think that there is something to somebody losing someone, having a heartbreak, and then trying to replace them with somebody who looks just like them to to comfort themselves, I mean, this is exactly why I never want to see any of the girls I date's exes. Because either way, you're going to find a problem with it. If they look like you, if they don't, you're going to find an issue with it when it really shouldn't be an issue at all. This is not a problem. Now, again, don't let Moe's high roadness here make you think that you're a freak. Because we talked about this a couple of days ago, and I did a poll online, and 75% of people go back and they do deep dives on social media into the person that they start seeing. So that makes Mo the freak. I'm the freak, for sure. (laughs) Cassie, don't be secure secure on this show. That will definitely make you the freak, okay? (laughs) Cassie. Oh, you gotta ditch this guy. That's weird and creepy. If I (laughs) dated a guy who had only dated redheads, I would be out of there so fast. Why? It's weird because I don't feel special because you, it's just, I feel like a carbon copy off a factory line and you're just like working your way through them one by one and it's just gross and weird. Maybe that's just what he's really attracted to are redheads. Right. Right. Well, get a little variety. Would you eat someone who just ate Wonder Bread all day? Like, no. <laughs> what are you saying? You are the Wonder Bread in the, of the dating world? 
I mean, I am. Look at me. I'm super white. I'm like the most Wonder Bread thing out there. But I just find it like creepy if it's a series of people. Like if you happen to look like one of his past exes from long ago, whatever, that happens. But if you can sit like the style is the same. That's the thing. It's not just the feature. She says the style is the same. And all of her friends think it's weird. I think you can leave nicely before he kills you and no add him to your trophy collection. Yeah. <laughs> now, Cassie's convincing me now because a man. Imagine, uh, so yes, a series of redheads, five or more. Let's say it's a white guy that only dates a certain race, and you just consistently see them with a certain race, and then it's like, that's a little, is that a little weird? Would that be weird? No, uh, it wouldn't be Is that be like a normal. collection? Mm. For some reason, that's not weird to me. No. <laughs> that's yeah. not the redhead thing? I was sitting there thinking, okay, like I knew a guy that only dated Asian women, and then they were like, he fetishes it, he fetishizes us, and it's weird. And I was like, you know what? You're right. Right. And like, don't hang out with him anymore, but made friends with all of his girlfriends. <laughs> no, I, just I don't know. think he has a t- He likes that look. Yeah. I don't know. That's what he's into. Yeah. Well, then if you're fine being called by his ex-girlfriend's name, go for it. Because <laughs> that's how he's going to see you. Oh, man. The Bird Show. <laughs>